Hello dear traders and welcome to another update on the market. For today I decided to cover USD versus Canadian dollar. I will speak about the gold market, crude oil and Bitcoin versus US dollar. I will start with the USD versus Canadian dollar first. So as alerted in the previous forecasts, um, the downside move on the USD Canadian dollar is uh, doing fine uh, since uh, relative to our previous forecasts. And the breakout of this multi-day balance to the downside of happening like a two trading days ago um, is now taking in basically sellers are in control and we can see today that market is trading below the pre uh, previous day low uh, which was at 1.3556 and we can see also on the hourly time frame that market is respecting this 20 uh, moving average and basically had some bear flag most recently and I still see potential, maybe after some correction intraday on a 5 and 15 minute time frame, there is a potential for the further downside movement. And the downside objectives for today are set at 1.3530 and 1.3515 levels. And uh, the, the levels are from the uh, daily time frame. We can see there is a cluster there. So this area can be potential magnet and uh, it will be kind of, kind of important pivot to watch. If we speak about the gold market, the gold market is in a consolidation for already, I will say, like a six days. Um, market is basically coiling here and uh, more building like um, um, a triangle here and still uh, is in this coiling process. So um, it's a basically a scalp only uh, market at this stage from my perspective. I don't see anything meaningful uh, from the longer time frame. So. If you, if you see also the weekly time frame, we have we're building this inside week so far, so absolutely coiling on different time horizons from the daily to weekly, right? So we can see, uh, and overall, it's also all over the place on intraday scale. So I would like to see the breakout, the bigger breakout of this uh, triangle of this contraction, and that can confirm for the direction. Uh, maybe if we can clear aggressively 1950 and go aggressively downside and it can open the door for 1900 to be and 1910 to be on the test from other side if we clear in the next period the uh, 2000 mark we can open the door for uh, higher prices and um, um, maybe even for the price towards you know 2050 2080 level but so far mark is coiling the potential for the breakout in the next period on this market uh, speaking of the crude oil, um, as I said, um, you know, nothing really changed in this uh, in this area. Uh, I still see potential for a test uh, of 76, uh, uh, 30, 76, 60 area, even 77, 40 area. Uh, market had more like a two day balance, the uh, last two days for balancing. And uh, I still see potential six hours and just in the pullback. So it might be like uh, uh, building more like a uh, flag on a six hour time frame and we still have a higher high and higher low on the weekly time frame so i have a positive expectation uh, for the crude oil at least towards that 76 40 76 60 area uh, speaking of the bitcoin versus us dollar we finally had actually we had that breakout that we pointed yesterday that we might if we see the breakout that this can lead towards the uh, 29,000, and that exactly happened but once we reached the 29,000, we had a problem and uh, the market actually uh, hesitated to go through and continue to go and hold upside. So at this stage, uh, what we can see is that the market is testing this key, this key resistance and uh, if the market cannot overtake again uh, 29,000, I will say two, uh, 200, uh, then there is a chance for rotation back into this daily consolidation. All right, so we have this daily consolidation here. So maybe there is a chance to back towards the 27,700 or even 27,000. In case of the break of 29,200, if you can really hold above, then this can open the door for, for example, 34, 35,000 to be on the test. So far, Bitcoin is trading just around the previous day high, uh, around this uh, 28,682. Uh, that will be all for this update. I hope that you did enjoy. Um, uh, trade safe and speak to you from tomorrow morning.